Ready, set, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Now high five each other successfully. Elbows, elbows. Hey guys, and welcome back to another Unfiltered Gamer board game live stream for the game uh, Wormhole to Uranus. We are going to be playing cooperatively, mostly, uh, a crossing Earth through a Wormhole to Uranus. It's a drinking party game. We're trying to get through card to card to card to card through the Wormhole, achieving objectives and completing strategic uh, missions, uh, doing some funny antics along the way. If we can get all the way across and survive, we'll win. Otherwise, we'll perish through the Wormhole and we will not make it to Uranus, which I guess is a very important mission. Maybe there's life there. I don't know. Sorry bodies just come like jumping out of the wormhole in I, I, or something. I don't think that's, I don't know. <laughs> We're well, already playing as a bunch of different flunky characters, random and randomized characters, uh, whether it be maybe the nerdy scientist or the useless rich guy or the uh, star of the sequel, perhaps the uh, super hot hero. Okay. Probably me. Uh, hey. Probably me. <laughs> You're missing um, the super hot and the hero part, though. So. No, that's true. But otherwise, Villain, it's all maybe. true. No. <laughs> so we're going to take you down below and show you the game. I get started with explaining how the game works and giving out our characters to play the game. Wormhole to Uranus. <laughs> Welcome aboard. As you know, the Earth has been destroyed in a nuclear holocaust during a civil war between nuclear historians and nuclear holocaust deniers. Hmm. <laughs> you have been handpicked to colonize and populate a new planet to keep humanity alive. That planet is Uranus. No. Not the Uranus you're thinking of. A brand new one capable of sustaining life that has been discovered light years away. Why call it Uranus? Because New York in America was named after York in England after being purchased and colonized by the English. And this Uranus is named because this game was written by an eight-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> I like the logic there. <laughs> you have just awakened from cryogenic sleep after passing through a wormhole into a vast and dangerous corner of the universe, traversing this stretch of space to reach your new home. You are the best of the best. Well, maybe not the best of the people that aren't dead yet. Uh, good luck and science speed. Okay, so let's go ahead and begin the game. Uh, the first thing we're doing is randomly drawing a character from all of these guys silently and secretly and even maybe seductively. And shuffle these guys up for you. I mean, you don't have is to. Not, it's not going to be secret, no. It's oh, not secret? Okay. No. Well, I mean, it's secret. You, you choose randomly. Well, yeah, you, you don't see what you choose, but so it's okay. after that, it's not a secret. Oh, you reveal once you pick uh, yeah. your character. <laughs> Which one am I supposed to choose? Then? Uh, Any of them. Maybe, maybe this yeah. one. I am the bounty hunter. Uh, hi, my name is Michael, and that's all you're getting to, for free. And let's get one thing straight. I'm only here for the money. And nothing, and I mean nothing, is going to soften my heart and make us friends by the end of this. Got that? I have good skill and good luck. Uh, my first quirk is I don't do anything without getting paid first. Whenever a mission involves me, a crew member has to give me something or do something for me first. Always ask, what's in it for me? Oh, I love that. That's a great, this is a great one. Um, I'm also a lone wolf. I stand away from the playing surface, off in the corner, or looking out a window until I'm needed. Okay, well, in this in this uh, enactment, I'll just probably be like this. Disinterested. Uh, all right, and that's what I do. So I'm, I have to be, you have to, you have to give me rewards to do stuff, and you have to uh, act like I'm not really here until I need to be. Um, speaking of that, I'm, I'm out of here. You guys do what you need to do. Well, that'll be easy for my character. I am the useless rich one. <laughs> my name is Eris Lee, and I am the owner of this ship, therefore the owner of all of you. I have much more money than God. If God had much money as me, he would have built a ship as grand as this one, found by me now. <laughs> all right. <laughs> my intelligence is actually good, and so is my charisma. My is quirk. Really good, though? It is good. <laughs> and my quirk one is that I am richer and better than everyone, and they know it. If challenged, I will yell, This is my goddamn ship. <laughs> and then I'll take out my wallet and count my money in front of the crew. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to have somebody fetch my wallet for me on that one. My other quirk is that I do not fully open my mouth while laughing because I'm a rich old creep. All right. Hello, everyone. My name is K. 
Kaz from the planet Pluto. Yes, it is a planet. Uh, Kaz was the first alien species to interact with humans. Kaz doesn't eat people. Raw. That is a joke on Pluto. Kaz discovered Uranus and knows how to get you there safely. I am meh at everything. I'm just, I'm just all right. I can do a little bit of everything. Uh, I mean, Kaz can do a little bit of everything. Because <laughs> I have... Because Kaz has to speak in the third person. <laughs> All game. <laughs> and despite being a highly advanced humanoid creature, Kaz hasn't developed the use of thumbs yet. So Kaz has no thumbs and has to play with... All four claw-like oh, fingers. That's <laughs> <laughs> like, you can probably hold your drink like that. Yeah. Okay. I'm the advanced android. My name is non-android. I am a human, just like you. I was, I mean, I was born in a hospital. I love baseball. Long walks on the beach. I hate sand and water. They jam up my, I mean, they jink, pet, I mean, skin. Resetting. I love baseball. All right. What about your, your uh, quirks? Uh... And what you're I'm good intelligent, at. strong, and skillful. Mm-hmm. My charisma and luck is not good. <laughs> well, what do you have to do during the game? Oh, quirk one. I speak like a robot. Interpret <laughs> that however you want. Also, the series of gears and pistons that make up your body emit very subtle noises as you move. Your highly advanced synthetic skin can't always mask your lack of internal organs. Say error after you take a drink. I am the steel form. My name is Max. I am the one with the accent, so it is far in the future. I'm not even from the country. Country was destroyed before I was born, but I am from space anyways. I'm very good with machines. Oh my fucks, the machines are exploding. I am good with my intelligence. Well, more meh, but you know. You're meh at everything. I am meh with You're good at skill, and that's it. A useless team. I am meh at everything. My charisma, I don't care. I fix shit. <laughs> my luck, meh. My quirk is, for some reason, if you still have an accent decades after Earth's existence, speak with the accent of the country of choosing. Yay. Apply that to your bio. My quirk number two is the machine you are working on is constantly on the verge of failure. Whenever a mission seems too difficult, yeah, she just can't do it, Captain! (laughs) I disagree with that, Max. I'm just saying. This is my goddamn ship. (laughs) I fix this ship. A useless team member. If it's your ship, you can be in charge of the staff sheet, since Kaz does not have thumbs to write with. All right, now once you've learned your character, it's time to introduce yourself. We all did that. Well done. Vote on a captain based on your crew member's introductions. As a group, count to three and point to vote. The player with the most votes is the captain. No voting for yourselves. Um, donkey holes. Fingers up, and you all have to vote. And like, as soon as I say the word three, just pick somebody. One, two, three. Oh. Okay. <laughs> all right. Eris Lay, I suppose you will be our captain. Sounds about right. So I'll look at the captain card. I'm going to go ahead and give you the captain card. This is for you for now, but it may uh, transfer from player to player, depending on how well you do on the missions. If the captain fails one mission or crew mission is failed, they lose their job as captain and pass the role to the person to their right. Upon losing their title, the former captain must drink heavily. Uh, The new captain makes a rule for the ship and the option to revoke the old rules. So go ahead and make a rule for the ship. Kind of like King's Thumb or... Thumbs, wars. I think you're talking about King's Cup, but my rule for this ship is that you must also add to the end of my name, Eris Lee von Lichtenstein. So, okay. I'm so just saying. Add that. some more. rules, I think, are drink, drink, drug. You may not use names. Must not look person in eye. Fine. I guess you are challenging me on my goddamn ship. <laughs> but. I am doing what humans do. Perhaps Fine. no swearing. Since we are I family think family. that is also a really good one. I should probably um, change this to gosh darn. Yes. Um, and yes, no swearing is a good rule. 
Which, for everyone. Okay, that's the rule. And no drink, drink, or drunk. That's also swearing words, according to me. Um, last is the group decide on a ship name. Uh, Human ship. Unbreakable. <laughs> the best ship ever. The friendlies. We are the not gamers. agreeing. The we gamers are not are. agreeing. <laughs> Maybe the unfiltered we all ship. <laughs> Hands up. One, two, three. Okay, that's me then. This with two. Unbreakable it is. A good, strong mercenary ship name. <laughs> I um, hope I can keep it from So I placed Earth down, and then I've separated Uranus, and then I've placed 25 cards so that you can see this is the traversal, like, our little, like, I don't know what you want to call it, like our journey to get there. And uh, we are ready to play the game. So what's going to happen now is uh, that each player, each card contains a task, and those tasks are assigned to one crew member, two, or the entire crew. They're solo, duo, and crew missions. Um, oh, don't drop things. Uh, huh. uh, boring travel cards will just let you move without a task. Uh, space madness cards make the cards pass the time between necessarily tasks. Move to the next card once these cards are completed, and there are no negative consequences unless otherwise specified. Uh, tasks that involve dice rolling will correlate to a specific, specific character attribute and, it, and is emboldened on the card. Uh, so, it's, for instance, if you need to use your strength for something, it'll say strength. Um, the role required to pass will be noted on your character sheet. Uh, some tasks will require you to physically complete them, and some instructions will be emboldened. Those tasks will be timed using a specific hourglass. Tasks that require timing will have this symbol on them. It's a little hourglass symbol. Uh, turn over the timer once the top half of the card is read. Lift off. The journey begins with the captain turning over the first travel card leading away from Earth. And read the top half out loud. Captain. Things are getting hairy out there. Space Human Resources is cracking down on relations with subordinates. Use your strength to fight off somewhat wanted um, things from crew members. Because we're family friendly, I'm not going to say the word, but. <laughs> oh, unwanted. Advances. Advances. Advances, yeah. advances from crew members. Yeah. Um, so there. Uh, so basically, yeah. After you read that, the task on the card will complete uh, be completed by the person on the right of the drawer of the card, unless it's specified otherwise. There's going to be an arrow that is pointing yep. on the card. So this okay. is a solo mission. This okay? is for Kaz. If it's passed, the player to the right of the captain draws the next card in the line and reads it, and continues clockwise from there. The crew member that completed the task keeps the card in front of them, keeping track of their past rewards or fail consequences. Keep track of individual fails and the provided staff sheet. If you accumulate three fails, you're out. Uh, at this point, you must chug your drink, die dramatically, and remain in an immobilized death state. You must also drink any time the crew member pours one out in your memory. The captain will be credited a fail or failed crew mission. Uh, now play. Come back to step six if you make it to Uranus. That's pretty much how the game works. Kaz will roll for strength. Seven. I need... Kaz needs five to eight to pass. <laughs> And got a seven. So you succeed. Yay. So you get to read it, right? Oh. Oh, I'm, you did. Finish Who reading. Did? Oh, you can read the captain, okay. sure. Captain can oh. read it. It doesn't matter. So you pass. Move on to the next card, consequently. Nice. Con oh. Consensually? That. <laughs> consensually. That's always good. That's very good. All right. Uh, <laughs> Kaz, you're up. Go ahead and draw the card and flip it over. And read it, and then based on the arrows, determining the mission, will determine who is going to be participating. This is a solo mission. There is a fight between two crew members over science fiction movies. Use your charisma, non-android, to determine if Star Wars is better than Star Trek. This is science fiction. Does not compute. I am not good with charisma. Good luck. I did not do well with charisma. Non-android failed. <laughs> you use there instead of there in a sentence. It's spelled differently. And apparently their social media grammar not n-words. I mean, I don't know if I can say this word on here. The person uh, to your right may post on your Facebook and you can't delete it. Take a fail.
Wonderful, error, Max. You'll have, you'll have the option to use his Facebook <laughs> at the end of the stream for something wonderful. Error, maybe, error. Maybe it'll be like, choose to back, or choose to buy. Um, this could be experience. some mm. quite fun stuff to sit there and post onto his timeline of shenanigans. Mm. And I believe we move on. Yep. And you did fail, so... And... Non-Android uh, received a fail. This. Crew mission. You had a major breakthrough in your research, but you need all the technology and skill you got to complete it. Each player must stack their phones one at a time while balancing said stack on the game timer. Oh. Kaz needs their phone, please. <laughs> What's in it for me? <laughs> Kaz's phone is on the counter. What's in it for me? Um, I'll be friendlier. <laughs> Thank you. I guess. Okay. Begin the challenge. Oh, it's a time challenge. No. No. Nope. We must use the oh. timer to stack our phones. Okay. I'm not sure about you guys, but this looks like, you know, reverse Tetris or something, or like whatever it's called, where you stack them. I play I'm human games like so Tetris. Yeah. This is all about violence and coordination. Bible's turn to come in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Say, <Save. laughs> uh, what do I get for doing it? Um, glory. <laughs> I don't do anything like in pain. You do not get to fail in the eyes of your captain, Eris <laughs> Levon Lichtenstein. Receipts in the mail. <laughs> Easy. Kaz has the pop socket, so <laughs> we a little succeeded. more challenging. <laughs> we may create a machine that may reanimate the corpse of one dead crew member. They may return to the game. However, one failed mission will result in their permanent redeath. Well, I imagine no one's passed, so grab your communication devices. I suppose. <laughs> I don't like this being ordered around, though. Kaz is glad we got this one earlier rather than later. <laughs> I will take back In the my journey. human communication device. <laughs> a successful crew mission. Had that we had we failed, however, you would have lost the captain card and it would have moved on to Kaz. Um All right, Max, you're up. A uh, question, does the if it's a crew mission, it stays in front of cuz it's supposed to be if it's a solo mission in front of the person who completed it. So if it's a crew mission, since we all completed it, doesn't it get to stay in front of all of us? It was my I know heart. that if it, I know that if it was a failed mission, it would go to you. But as it passed... So since we passed and I was the leader of this crew, does it come to me? Nope. Him. <laughs> I am a successful human. <laughs> You may think you're a successful human, but space is boring right now, so I'm going to take myself a drink and move ahead. Cheers to the unbreakable. Okay. Well, I just said okay. That's all. Why am I even bothering moving across here? Is there a if you wish to get any sort of reward, we must reach our destination. <laughs> Looks like we've come across a solo mission uh, for our captain. The ship flew way too close to a solar flare and things started to heat up around the quarters. Uh, oh put your drink in the microwave for 45 seconds. Don't put metal cans in the microwave, please. <laughs> I mean, if we're taking this in a technological Gosh. sense I can leave it in there for 45 minutes and not turn anything seconds. on uh -huh. seconds <laughs> seconds thank you non-android for your correction did it say to turn the microwave on it did not actually 
So you can keep your drink nice and cold. Just well, leave it in the microwave. Max, since you are closer to the That'd fine Michael. That will Why be, am I doing this? Uh, There's much <laughs> reward hunter. for you in this. Believe me. I'm surrounded by cables and wires from all my machinery. That ain't gonna happen. I know I'm called the useless rich one, but I don't think that's me right now. Well, rich, yes. Useless. No. While it sits there in the microwave without it being on for 40 seconds, go ahead and take the next card. I suppose, as I look dramatically into the window. <laughs> um, so I pass that mission, right? So that card goes in front well, of me? Well, you will. Okay, fine. Well, this is a solo mission for Kaz. An enemy space rocket hit one of the ship's airlocks, to, and everyone might get sucked into space. Oh, darn. Shut every door with... <laughs> hmm. Are humans Excuse laughing? Me. Should I laugh? Ha-ha. It's okay, Ha-ha. man, Android. Ha-ha. I thought, thought you were a human. I am a human. I'm laughing like humans. Ha 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 ha. Shut every door within the house to prevent your brains from exploding. <laughs> Kaz says doors are closed. Um, every door in the house, even bedroom and bathroom doors. Internal doors, not just external doors. It just says every door in the house. I bet. Kaz will be back. Kaz will be back. Kaz, you must drop all airlocks for all And you might as well grab that uh, drink from the microwave, so I'm not going to do it. Thank you so much, Kaz. (laughs) So kill the airlocks. I guess I'll read the next card for you. Well, it looks like Kaz might be having some fun. Space is boring right now. Drink and move ahead. Cheers to the Unbreakable. Oh. Error, error. No drink for you. Not yet. Kaz is coming. <laughs> Let me help you with that, Kaz. Thank you right. so much. You I have believe been such it's a uh, non-Android's turn now. Woo-hoo! Except you have to, you have to drink, Kaz. That was oh. part of your card. And Kaz, this Cheers goes to you. To the unbreakable. And this is mine. Space madness, cabin fever. You're tired of being cooped up and need to stretch your mechanic. I mean legs. Line up by height. The tallest crew member and the shortest crew member must feed each other their drink. Don't laugh, person in the middle. If you are playing with an odd number of people, you take a shot. All right. So who's uh, the shortest person here? Max or Callie? Kaz? Kaz is... <laughs> Kaz is five, I'm, six I'm and a half. I'm sorry. I feel like I've actually Max heard is five, several... seven, so I believe Kaz is the shortest. I have heard several people mention a word that begins with a D. We must feed each other our liquid and refreshments. You might need to have several. And person in the middle, do not laugh. Error, error. I'm moved for that one. <laughs> I may be useless, but I'm at least um, somewhat here. Okay, yes. what you gotta do is just hook damn fingers into the handle. That way it's easier for you to pick up your drink. No, 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 hook. Hook it. I think that's hooked quite good, Max. Kaz is okay. Kaz is okay. Mission complete. Kaz did not have the finger strength. Mission complete. (laughs) All right. This is a duo mission. The radar is malfunctioning and you are on the verge of getting lost. The assigned member with the left the least left in their cup must close the, your eyes and make another drink using only the guidance of I'm, the other member's voice. I'm so sorry, Max. What was that word that you just used? It begins with a D. Drink. Oh, you and used another. it again. <laughs> okay. Just wanted to make sure. So, you know. 
Now, this dual mission is for our favorite android and our favorite bounty hunter. Is it the person with the lowest amount left in their receptacle? <laughs> yes. What this person has very full receptacles. Half. Receptacle. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not. Lowest receptacles. Between two. Percentage left in drink. Lowest percentage left in drink. Our captain is at 66%. So, what do we need to do? I'm, and I'm so sorry, Nan Android. What was the word that you just used to begin? Error. <laughs> <laughs> you must close your eyes. Oh, I understand. And have the other person give you the guidance to inhale your drink. Mm. <laughs> right. Guidance or <clears throat> construct a new concoction? <laughs> All right. Um, once again. Construct a new concoction. So I have to do this, and she's going to have to tell me what to do to, to get it right. Make right another beverage using only the guidance of the other member's voice. Make a beverage. Gotcha. I will be nice and let you stand first, I suppose. Oh. I suggest you oversee what he is doing. I shall return. <laughs> Unless he is okay, going to bring them to bringing. the table. Bring you to table. Over here. Yes, I gotta do that. <laughs> I think that that's a better idea. What? Yes. Good job, Kat. And maybe What's move all communication What's devices. Our base, Margarita base. It's pre mixed. It's in the fridge. And my oh. name is Kaz. <laughs> <laughs> Please hold during this momentary. Loading. Loading. It is hard to. Uh... This is this is a little. All right, we'll, we'll do our best. Ha 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 ha. This shall be an interesting um, buffering beverage. What I beverage is say. this? <laughs> this is this is what I've got right there on the counter. So Pretty sure it's called. The you guys don't even pay me for this, so I don't even know why I'm bothering. But you the, may the mark... use any liquid on the table to help him construct his beverage. His my, human beverage. Uh, eyes closed. Oh, okay. I see what you are saying there, non-android. No. Do, you, do people see words? I see words. Do yes, people, people see, see words. words okay. All right. Loading. Okay. So move your left hand over, over down. There you go. Go all the way further down to the handle now. Okay. And put your right hand closer, closer, closer to you, and move it up the spout and twist that cap off, please. Thank you. Now you are going to, yes, move your hand towards that. They're going to pick that up. Thank you. Use your hand and just pour, but make sure you don't spill very nicely. Continue, continue. You're not pouring anything yet, sweetheart. <laughs> just keep on going. There's much in this. For you. Stop. Just stop. Okay, you're good. You can set down the handle beverage and set down your glass as well. Okay, set, set it down. There you go. There. Yes, that was a good spot to set down. I'm really great with um, things, obviously. Now, move your left hand. Left hand. Nope. Move that just past, past the bo bottle. Yep, yep. So that one, bring that over to you. These instructions are inefficient. <laughs> well, my sorry. Okay, I'm my whatever. Now use your left hand to grab the cup. There you go. And and pour. Your pour. Continue to pour. You're not pouring anything yet, dear. Pour more. Pour you more. The bottle at 36.2 degrees. That too. And stop. And then you can set down the beverage over over down. There you go. Now there's the cap. Okay. And you can just, there you go. Okay, and now I have to also make sure he feeds it to himself. <laughs> no, we're not gonna worry about anything else there. So there's a cup, is this he is supposed to? This is less entertaining. To... And then now just, you bring that to your lips, bring that to your lips, yep. And just drug back down the hatch, keep going. All of it? 
I don't what know. Does what does the say? card say? No. no. Must, stop, no. Stop, 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 Oh. <laughs> See, there was your reward. <laughs> that could have been so much more entertaining. No. I suggest a human beer. <laughs> a splash for flavor. Well, non the beer. Android. <laughs> Non-Android. It's, you know, it just doesn't mix well. <sighs> You should know this as a human, right? Yeah, I mean, I'm an alien. I, am I a know human. beer and I beer. I ingest human beer. Error, <laughs> error. Uh, okay, Loading. wonderful. Okay. And he is like Bender. I feel like my pocketbook is going to be uh, heavily sedated at the end of this trip. <laughs> success, Michael. Success. That was a success. A crew mission. mission. Emergency. Someone bumped the self destruct button. Why is it right next to the microwave? Everyone go to. Wow, that actually worked really well. Uh -huh. Everyone go to the escape pod, meaning fit the whole crew on the piece of furniture the drawer is sitting on. The what is the drawer sitting on? Is sitting on. It's next to the next to the microwave. Fit everybody onto the drawer. A piece of furniture the drawer is sitting on. I do not believe a drawer is sitting on anything. Are we talking about the counter? Sounds like we're talking about the counter. Oh, the draw, D -D -R -A -W -E -R. The drawer. D-R-A-W-E-R. Oh, everyone has to sit on my lap. Oh. This is you going drew to the be car. complicated. the drawer. <laughs> Well, we this have to just fit the whole crew on the piece of furniture, so not necessarily. Um, this is going sit to on. break. Wait, that... <laughs> um, it's a little wooden stool you're sitting on, right? May we stand oh, on, on the rungs? Oh, these ones are... We might stand on the rungs and lean on the side and I hold guess... on to each other, oh, but put your foot <laughs> near the I leg. I think a fail might be in order for this one because I'm afraid to break this. This furniture is not made for uh, a I lot of hundreds of pounds. Are now see what we do it is take, pieces of take comfort. it, flip it over. Everybody put that foot on it. That way it is foot on wood. Then we all just lean in and give each other a hug. And that way we are all on top of it at once with no damage to the piece. You know, as the captain... I fail. I will accept this failure. <sighs> <laughs> on this gosh darn sh ship of mine. Humans are inefficient. I mean, we are inefficient. That, yeah. So, um, I suppose... Kaz is captain. <laughs> I Kaz is now captain. And if you want to, Kaz, you can get rid of my, you know, rule of... You did get a card, though. I get a card. <clears throat> new rule, Kaz? A new rule for the um, game? Kaz can choose to keep or remove old rules. Um, I will discard the D-word rule and keep the no swearing rule. Okay. Okay. Instead Guess... of a new rule. Okay. Well, Kaz, um, you have a solo mission now. Mm. Yes. The onboard computer operating system help anyway. still uses dial-up internet. I know, right? Dial-up internet. Oh. We're literally surrounded by satellites. Use your intelligence to update the computers. Roll the die. Her right. intelligence Kaz is needs meh. a five to sit to eight. Could be okay. Five. Oh, wow. Success. success. Congratulations success. on your success, Kaz. Kaz is very successful. <laughs> so much in per first person narratives. <laughs> we have a solo mission for non Android. It is a time mission. You may have to fly the ship at some point. Prove you know how to fly anything by running to the nearest mailbox and back within the allocated time. I'll let you get up and move around the camera equipment first. <laughs> that will be a good idea. And then you just have to make it under the stairs there. Um, and the first thing I gotta do is actually I'll pan the camera to the door so that way you they can see him. Uh, give me the time. <laughs> well, this shall be interesting, Kaz. Yeah. Let's go ahead and There's change some... this to full frame. Our ship has some uneven walkways, so this may be interesting. You might want to do that for some added traction. Okay. Otherwise, interesting. that would be really funny. Um, Max, please. On your marks. Get set. Go. 
This Android isn't all that fast. I mean, non-Android. I need to close the door. But the <laughs> little the little pup is right there, so I mean, he made I'll the correct choice. I'll away. <laughs> My yes, escape. again, I'll stall away. And he has succeeded in his challenge to make it and to the mailbox. Human, human, <laughs> Success. Success, Success for non-Android. Congratulatory. I don't know about that non-Android sometimes. Humans run quickly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm curious my neighbors are like, why did that dude just run out there and touch the mailbox? <laughs> that is what dudes do. Yes. <laughs> Give him a success, success. card. Success. I have no successes except for a dual mission, which is also credit to somebody else, I imagine. You're welcome. Not that I care, since I don't work on the ship anyway. This is a solo mission for Max. In difficult situations, you need to remain calm and remember your training. Name four of your elementary school teachers while crew members scream in your ears. Is it timed? No. Yes. What are you saying? What are we saying to you? What are your names? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, G. What are you doing? What's going on? Come on, you can do this. Success. Congratulations. He burned your guys' ear out, maybe. Um, I tried to protect. Uh, yeah, it was, it was fine. It's, I, I was watching the thing, so I only went to the yellow mode. I tried to keep it so it doesn't blast your ears too badly. This is a group mission, sorry, duo mission. A small group this is sent to missions. make a black hole market weapons deal. It went south, and the draw of the card got shot. So I got shot, apparently. <laughs> The draw of the card go limp. The crew members assigned must care then to Neil's bathroom. Who are the assigned crew members? The nearest crew members would be that my is Android myself and, and the bounty hunter. hunter. Give me that. I can't understand your whatever you're talking about. We must carry no. him to the bathroom. Someone shot him, of course. Carry to the nearest bathroom? Do you want hands or legs? <laughs> or failure. When am I getting paid for this? Oh. Kaz, do you want me to still I need a drink of the beer you want me to mark me for you still, Kaz, with your opposable thumb issue? I'm good. Okay. It's not as good as the original, but... I agreed. Um, alright, Kelly. Come here, go ahead. yeah, you can go around. I'm gonna need you to. Hey, you gotta go over Sorry. here. Yeah. Start over here. Um. Oh, man, this is gonna be dangerous. All right, we're limped in this baby. Ship. Hold it. It's easier. I'm gonna be limp like this that way, and then we're gonna change the ISO too. No. I will comment for or provide commentary for everybody that's watching this. This is going to be very interesting, obviously. I think they have it. It looks like they might have it. I think they'll get it. Um. Interesting. Interesting. I think I, sweat all the way across the floor. Why is there sweat on the floor? Well, it looks like they survived, I suppose. <laughs> Did you guys get to amend and heal Max or whatever? They should sure not did. Yet, you know. There was no blood on my gosh darn he was ship, repaired. right? I mean, he was repaired. You did not I mean. bleed on the ship, did you? Maybe a little bit. 
That might come out of your salary. Try it. <gasps> you get a salary? <laughs> I fixed this ship. Without me, this ship ain't going nowhere. I'm just a friendly alien. <laughs> <laughs> No offense, but why you? <laughs> I couldn't even Cali. I mean, I mean, dang it. Yes, I don't. Who is this Cali you keep speaking of? Go. Do you know who this Cali is? Uh, okay, whose turn is it? I can only. I, I suppose you that it's yours. You better hope you never go limp in my pool because you're going. You're not. You're going to pass away. <laughs> At least in the pool, <laughs> buoyancy takes into effect. Space madness. Did you know they found evidence of a waterfall on Mars? Start a waterfall. <laughs> <laughs> so I start drinking and you all continue drinking until I stop drinking. We have Which to way? continue drinking until she's, you know, eat first. Well, sorry, yeah. the I start drinking and them. then you have to start. Yes. And then she'll have to start. And when I stop, you can stop and vice, and vice versa. I understand the concept. Okay, just, well, they don't. Okay. So, giving an example of the audience. So when I start, then we're going to go. Three, two, one. It's right. <laughs> a wonderful beverage. <laughs> All right, a success for the uh, for error, the crew. Error, error. Um, no, not this one. This one was a fail. Which one was it? The water. Um, it was right one. here. Ah, yes, to the unbreakable. Okay. <laughs> All right, uh, you're up. Here you go. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, this is a duo mission. For Michael and Kaz. No. I don't have to carry you, um, do I? It's tough to shoot targets with this. Um, <laughs> Impediment? Device? I, I'm trying to be it's, um, um, donkey, family hole, right? donkey hole piloting. Acclimate yourselves to the G-forces of space combat by doing seven spins on a dizzy bat on opposite sides of the room and successfully high-fiving each other. Well, do we our hosts be, have a dizzy sure. bat? A dizzy bat. A dizzy bat. A bat. You need a would bat that you put your back forehead to and, and spin. spin around on. Do you guys have a broom? We don't have a broom. We have a broom. There we go. You, not a broom. A broom is too tall. You uh, need something approximately three and a half human feet long. But you need two. Not android. You're saying human I've got feet. A, I've got a, 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 a that is close enough in height. Hold it in front of you and spin around with your forehead near the upper end. I've also seen it non Android where you just hold it up to your head. It doesn't necessarily have to touch the floor. Okay. All right, I got this. So dear you Josh, need two though because I do got two. I do got two. Okay. Quiet, you Android looking. All right, I am not Android <laughs> because I am human. So he says. I like baseball. Alright. Buffering. So remember, you have to do it seven times. Don't drop it. On opposite sides of the room, okay. and then successfully high five each other at the end. I've got this. Take this. Put it, put it here. On opposite sides, right? Like so opposite across. sides of the room, or. Yeah, 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 that works. Okay, and we have to high five after we go around in circles? After you go around in oh, circles right seven right. times. So I'll count down for you guys. Ready? Set and go. One, high five. two, high five, right? three, oh, no, four, three. Oh my gosh. Five, five, six, six. and seven. seven. Now, now high five five each five. other successfully. <laughs> elbows, elbows. <laughs> 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 I don't know. Do you guys call that a success? I guess we can I call it a success. That will be a success. Well, but wait, can it be a high five if only one of the members has four digits? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think so. Oh, I, I think so. <laughs> no, Jonathan, no, no licking. <laughs> success. Um, success. Well, since you guys passed. Oh, I should have put it to full screen. 
<laughs> I suppose I need to take a beverage. I showed my teeth when I smiled. <laughs> well, since you guys passed, you can't reverse your own dizziness, but you can even things out for the rest of the crew. Make two crew members drink. And question on a duo mission, who gets the... She can decide. It's not me. Well, don't... Didn't you say you want one? Oh, <sighs> wait. I... Wait, what's in it for me? Why did I do that? <laughs> oh, you get to choose... Um, a, you guys both get to choose cr two Someone crew members. Two. That one. <laughs> okay. Non-android. What is my name? Non-android. Like <laughs> Harris... Lee with an EI. <laughs> yes. Error. That is Error. Eris. Yes. Eris. Okay. Here we go. We we have a crew mission. <clears throat> okay. So it's very important that we know our coworkers. So without cheating, so without looking at the staff sheet, you have to be able to name the person to your right by their character name. I'll go first. Non Android. This is Max. This is Michael Harris Lee. This is Kaz. Success! <laughs> you're up. <laughs> I don't mean Europa. That <laughs> space joke. This is a solo mission for Max. Mm. You will need a dice. An alien overlord is threatening you via Vidcom. Convince him with your charisma not to destroy your ship and eat your genitalia. Wow. So, <laughs> charisma I, check. I, I don't seven like or eight. this. Seven or eight. Seven or eight. Otherwise, eat My your genitalia. My own needs to stay step. right where it is. A uh, five. It. And he, I, you have the well, genitals. He, he did not blow up your ship, but he did eat your genitalia. <laughs> But just the tip. <laughs> Fashion your own athletic cuff for future protection. Stick a bowl down your pants. Take a fail. Stick a bowl down your No. I'm not sticking one of my bowls down your do pants. Do you not have styrofoam bowls? Oh, I do. Okay. Not Android. What is this styrofoam you speak They're of? They're in the corner it cabinet. It is a synthetic substance just like my... I mean, down below. it is synthetic... Below like where you're looking. Below where you're looking. Yeah. I didn't think human home was gonna be this well populated out in this part of the galaxy. Uh, that that disturbs me greatly. That is a fail. You want your bowl? Just the tip. <laughs> This may or may not be family This may friendly. not be family friendly. Not you got Android needs to start just by the individual. That image. is affirmative. <laughs> the gals are like, nah, we ain't even. <laughs> <laughs> We are almost to our destination. Come on, crew, we can do it. Yes, we can <laughs> on this wonderful ship. My wonderful ship. I feel like I could be like a first mate or something. You <laughs> feel so. like who? But you're a first mate. Aren't you the you captain, Kaz? Like oh, I am the captain now. I feel like Scott. <laughs> also, Kaz, 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 Kaz used a forgot, first person yeah. pronoun. Oh. All right, this is a crew mission. Everyone has different backgrounds to avoid future miscommunications. Everyone needs to be on the same page. Draw, that would be me. Start singing a song. Every crew member must know the words and sing for the duration of the timer. All right, start a song <clears throat> and then let me think. Wait, all of us have to do it at the same time? Correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have to all know the Everybody words. better know this one. Go ahead. Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear gamer. Happy birthday. And 
the transmission. <laughs> that was a good selection. When it came down to it, I was like, you know what? Everybody has to know that song. Why does everybody have to know that song? I only hear that because song. Because humans have me. birthdays when they were born. Solo mission. This is for you, Eris. There's a rumor going around that you don't belong on this ship. <gasps> One cares. Prove it by producing. This is my fishing. gosh darn ship. Produce it. Uh, prove it by producing a picture of yourself with any type of vehicle. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Show me a picture of you next to a vehicle just so that I know that you are uh, are worthy of being on the ship, I guess, even though I don't care why. Being somebody who hasn't gotten paid worth anything this entire journey is all promises. <laughs> empty promises she from an empty own crew. The ship, so she should be I do own the captain. ship. It is my, my ship. Kaz is our new captain, thank you very much. Um, but captain, I am still the owner of the ship. Owns the ship. Just well, saying. You got a, you got a picture to prove I'm this? finding it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, not that one. <laughs> hold on, hold on. <laughs> she goes closer. She pulls it in closer. All right, let me, let me get the um, camera. Is there a an image with your personage in a vehicle in the background? There is. Oh, um, I'm looking. <laughs> <laughs> I went to a specific event of when I got my current vehicle, not this, sh you know, wonderful ship. It was actually my, I guess, former vehicle. Um, hold on. It was exploded on Earth. <laughs> it was exploded on Earth. I mean, it makes sense, the type of car that I it was. I don't think I can fix that one. I think it is beyond my abilities to it's repair. It's beyond most people's abilities to repair. I had to get a new transmission on it, even though it wasn't even all that old. Transmission's fixable. It being blown to smithereens, that yes, is fixable. Yes, that was before it was blown up. You got one? I have one somewhere. Just hold. Just I wait. I believe <laughs> we should use the timer. Um, oh, here we go. Um, it's not just me. Loading. 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 Okay, 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 okay. Well, um, it's kind of a dark image but there's a motorhome in the background which is a very large recreational vehicle mm. yes very large recreational vehicle this is before my hair was you objective know. achieved recreation um, is fun like do we that. maybe need to up the brightness was it no, good. Objective okay, cool. achieved. good awesome thank you Mission success. Yeah. Thanks, Kai. Oh, I got a successful mission. There's only five left. You got this. Oh, this is me. Okay, I see what we're doing now. Am I grabbing from the right area? Yep. Okay. I love to right. Affirmative. Solo mission. It's Thursday. Trash day. On the ship, someone accidentally hit the evacuation button. With Kaz in the cargo hold. Use your luck, Kaz, to grab that conveniently placed handrail and avoid being ejected into space. All right, luck, you're gonna need a five or an eight. If the dice read five, five or two eight. Five, two, and eight, six. In the jungle, you must wait. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, you passed, Kaz. You may, you survived, but now you have PTSD. Post-trash space disorder. You can't be around trash. The crew has to clean up all of your messes and trash from now on. Ben? Pretty I <laughs> assigned that to Michael. <laughs> Are I you the captain of the ship? That. Not Android? All right, here you go. You ain't the captain anymore either. I'm not. I'm just asking questions. All right. I'm still the owner. This is a solo mission for non-Androids. The captain's seat is a very iconic position of authority. This is true. If you ever want to be captain, you need to find the ideal captain's seat. Find it by sitting on every player's lap and determining who has the most comfortable lap. <laughs> uh, I don't know what that answer is going to be. There is something unusual in his <laughs> pants. <laughs> uh, I, know, I know the truth. Come on. Don't worry. You won't feel anything much. Uh, Ooh. This is not entirely uncomfortable. Right, right. Yeah. It's a little squishy, but you know, it's got a little hardiness as well. 
<laughs> Callie. <laughs> I am crushed. Callie? Dang it! Stand up for It won't go anymore. I am afraid go. my internal machinations. I mean, organs are too heavy for <laughs> this seat. This seat is somewhat phony. <laughs> um. One more. Well, I guess you can. Hi there, non android. Hello. Hi. This seat is tilted and I cannot sit comfortably. <laughs> Ah. Angles are not conducive to sitting. And so, is there supposed to be a winner here, or you just have to get, you have to just sit? He has to choose. I believe our bounty hunter had the most level lap. While without I, obstruction. While I typically avoid interactions with other crew members, I was willing to oblige our helpful non-android Okay. <laughs> Player with his objective. The most comfortable lap has immunity from one consequences. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. Success. Crew mission. Is that a We're phone? Good. <laughs> <laughs> Turbulence shook loose some furniture. A table has fallen onto the puppy you keep aboard. Why do you have a puppy on board? <laughs> As a team, lift the game surface off the ground as is using one arm without spilling anything for the duration of the timer. Everyone must use one arm appendage. And commence mission. <laughs> one hand, one hand. Hopefully our stowaway does not go underneath the playing board. <laughs> And we must make sure that the legs are guided into the receptacles. <laughs> the puppy on board is dang cute. That's why he's here. Oh, he, I, I, he gives I, us great enjoyment. Max, you and I agree on this. All right. Objective fulfilled. <sighs> Easy peasy. Success. <sighs> Coming down to the last two, and then we have to do the super secret... Uranus mission. That's for me, dog. <laughs> is our dog under there? No. Where is Dante? Space madness. In space, nobody can hear you scream. Well, apparently nobody can hear you at all. Nobody can speak for the next three missions except to read the task and consequences of the card. Any speaking is punchable by shots. Hmm. Hmm. Solo mission for my player to the right. They say it's better to be lucky than good. There's a red dot on your forehead. Oh, and a space penny on the ground. Use your luck to bend over at the most convenient time. Oh. You got shot in the brain. Brains bleed a lot when that happens. Wrap your head in toilet paper to stop the bleeding and take a fail. Now that you have made it to Uranus atmosphere, all you have to do is land, which is the most difficult part for storyline purposes. Captain, turn over Uranus, marker, and follow the instructions. <clears throat> the final mission. Put a number one next to yourself on the staff sheet. Oh. Assign numbers to your crew numbers. Crew members counting up until everyone has a number. Assign extra numbers to cover any crew members that died before the final mission. Call out 
out your crew members by character name followed by their task and required attribute below. The assigned crew member's task will correlate to their number on the staff sheet. Skip tasks that are not assigned on the staff sheet. Now give a motivational speech to inspire your crew. Five, non-android. Stabilize the reactor with your skill. Four, Max, use your luck to put out that fire. Three, Michael, use your skill to clear the landing area. Two, Eris Lee, use your strength to brace for impact. your charisma to land the ship. The captain will call you individually for a task that you must complete by rolling the dice. That task will have an attribute attached to it. Use your character card to know what you need to pass. If you pass, respond to the captain with an affirmative. David, engage engines. Shields engaged. If you roll fails, you have died a fiery death. Act out an epic death or nobody will remember you and you won't be in the movie made about this day. Did the captain crash while landing the ship? Well, they're dead. Yep. Their dead is blank. Crew members with zero fails are the ones to drag themselves out of the wreckage. Everyone else is dead. Great job, Captain. Humanity is not doing so good. <laughs> so, Michael is the sole survivor of our ship. Now that we are done with the missions... We can speak. <laughs> I yeah, survived. Yeah, yeah. How is it? That the monk, where's the, the rest of my crew? <laughs> survived a crash where the mechanic didn't survive that. And they didn't even pay me! <laughs> I hope you guys had some fun watching us play some uh, normal to Uranus. Uh, it's, a, it's, a cool, it's a cool little um, interactive game that involves luck and some like unique. Um, it's not as heavy drinking as other games are, too, so you're not worried about the game. Well, there's more I rules like for there. drinking if you want to increase oh. the odds of drinking. Okay. Whenever somebody does this or that, you drink. If you fail, you drink. When a person okay. dies, you have to drink. And every honor their memory, you drink. Okay. Um, yeah, and you can increase the drinks. <laughs> yes. The fact okay. that I had to do a country accent the entire time, I was like. I think you misread that, though. They said pick a country and then have an accent from that country. So we picked yes. the USA. Yeah. Well, he kept saying the word, he's like, country. I'm like, no, no, you choose a country, and in that country you can have an accent. Oh, Although, I just thought he picked honestly, a good country choice. Country accent is one of the U.S. A good, good accents, choice so. of accents, in my opinion. Otherwise, yes. yeah. I don't know how long the video would be lasting. <laughs> um, well, but I had fun with my character, even though I couldn't do it all the time. Like, I wanted to be looking away, but... I it's must interact. I can't engage. Mm -hmm. as, so I kind of just looked away Mine partially. Was and, oh, yeah. So kind of I did fun. great as a useless mm -hmm. one. I guess I could have. <laughs> There's uh, some other ones here. We have the nerdy scientist, the star of the sequel, the obvious traitor. Mm. Oh, uh -huh. cool that would have been, been fine. You're a, you're a conniving Evil. creep. Sit with your hands tented like Mr. Burns and squint <laughs> suspiciously with your eyes. Where's that person's dice rolls? Uh, you put your own survival over everyone else. Berate other crew members when they fail missions while... Uh, <laughs> Uh, 
whisper scream threats at them. I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys did as well. I hope you enjoyed the live stream for the Amoral Hill 2 Uranus. Um, while wait as Max pulls out the, uh... His cup. Uh, you throw that away, I ain't oh, touching I plan on throwing that away, don't worry. If you're interested in more live stream stuff, it's every Sunday, 6.30 p.m. PST on Facebook, or you can join us on YouTube the day after, where I cut it up and edit it. And um, next week, we're going to have a another game with a giveaway. Um, most people should have gotten most of the giveaways by now, sponsored. We'll have a sponsored dice stream next week, too. So we'll have metal dice, we'll have legendary... Um, Thing, legendary metal dice, or all of the mm. dice. Um, and we'll also have a sponsor for, um, like, I guess they're little like uh, things you put stuff in, like the little like trays. dice trays and stuff like okay. that. Okay, really well, it can be used as a dice tray, like containers and whatnot that you can add, um, which are pretty cool. And I have a lot of cool games coming in to show you for Kickstarter. I'm excited to show you the ones that are showing down here. Um, maybe we'll do a live stream for uh, Underdark next week. I don't know. It might be more complex than a uh, stream like this would be good Between for. Between repetition coming up, or uh, that's coming up in September, actually. Okay. Uh, and actually, our the designer came over yesterday. So oh. I love seeing this stuff. Okay. Yeah. So you kind of gave him a tour around the house. Yeah. Um, and that's pretty much it. Nothing else to show you guys tonight. Um, yeah. I, I, I got no other updates other than Moonshell is being manufactured, and when we have the update, we'll let you know. On the, if you go on the Kickstarter, there is uh, some videos and some images of the uh, box being made in the, the back. Production. And, and exciting. That stuff. So that's pretty exciting. Uh -huh. And uh, also congratulations to Flamecraft. We did a review or a, of live streaming for that yes, game yes, yes, about a month ago, almost a month ago. Yeah. And like um, he hours. is at over a million dollars. So dang. It's a good yeah. game. I, I, I yeah, hope. It was a lot of fun. Hopefully it helped. Hopefully you guys it. were interested mm -hmm. in uh, taking a look at it. And um, great art. If you too. haven't, you can go ahead and do so. Uh, Flamecraft on Kickstarter for another couple days, I believe. Uh, I think September second. It's got about a week second. left. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. And it's not even the end of the campaign yeah. yet. They literally had to make it like an extra graphic just for the added uh, stretch goals because they and, kept adding more. And to be fair too, um, to it be was, fair. it's with Lucky Duck as well, so oh, they're gonna be international. Well, yeah, mm -hmm. Lucky Duck is like handling the translation oh, yeah. to other countries mm -hmm. and stuff. Yeah, so oh, really, really you. cool. Real, yeah, I mean, just a lot of fun. I, I, really I like thought fun. it would do well. I did cool. not, in my remember? imagination, think it would go to over a million dollars, but I did. I won. Okay, I remember. I remember. Uh, I know, yeah, we, we did kind of, I don't want to say stop Peter, but a bit of it, like, we definitively, you know, defeated him. Oh, Peter? Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, yeah. It was, When you're was explaining the, the game. He was yeah. being nice, I'm sure. Yeah. He wasn't playing John DeClaire style where he tries like to crush stop. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm waiting for his game. Oh, did you know, by the way, that um, John DeClaire's uh, game expansion for Edge of, Edge of Darkness actually Ooh. came out. It's another one of those card customization games. I actually yeah. just reviewed it not like too those. long ago. And um, I, I, I was like, shoot, I want to play this again. It's been a bit of time since I played it. But I knew Josh would like it. Mm -hmm. The new expansion apparently kind of connects the bridge between Mystic Vale and Edge of Darkness. Oh, interesting. Like, okay. Yeah. Like the like storyline, story like, yeah, of the world. Uh -huh. Oh, really? They're connected in some way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I must Ooh. look into this. All right. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, I look forward to seeing, seeing you guys, guys next time. time.